What's up, guys? Um, you know, it's been a while. It's been several years or three or four years since I've done anything here. Um, <clears throat> this is for your newly released jailbroken Amazon Fire Stick. Um, I'm only doing it kind of as an, as an exclusive thing right now, not necessarily doing it for, you know, all the 550 subscribers of YouTube that I currently have. This is for, if you Google it and you're interested, uh, you can learn how to jailbreak it you know different ways and uh, it's pretty complicated you know granted you don't jailbreak or you know brick your Amazon fire stick it's 40 bucks not a big deal but sometimes you can access the developer settings and do some you know more harm than you could good if you screw it up but anyways um, this is my fire stick um, it's the one that has Alexa's voice activated right there you can talk into it etc which is no good through Cody which is your third-party jailbroken uh, link or file if you would so anyways um, if you purchase my service uh, I've jailbroken your fire stick for you um, once you log in to your Amazon thing you're gonna see you can go down to apps because it's not gonna it's not gonna be on your home icon it may but I doubt it go down here to your apps and then you'll see your apps library and you're gonna see the ugly 480p blue Cody logo click on the Cody app and um, Mine's probably going to jump straighten up. Okay, it didn't. There it is. This is going to pop up. Uh, it may download some links and other good stuff, but it's okay. Don't worry about it. Um, also, keep in mind that you're watching this on a 4K TV, so, and I'm recording on a 1080p, so the quality may look like a little crappy, but irrelevant. You're going to pop up here. You're going to have music programs, system, videos, all those good submenus and menus, but none of those are really going to be convenient for you because if you use my you know my program and you know everything else that I've done for you you're only gonna to want to go over here to videos and you're gonna to go to add-ons you can go to files too but it saves it's, it's more time and you may screw something up so go to videos add-ons and then you're gonna yeah, hit OK on that nobody cares and then you're gonna have Exodus you see Exodus here is it's never let me down it's the one that I've come across more and more all over the YouTube land and Google and you know anyway so we'll click click on Exodus again it's gonna open up a menu file that's got new movies movies TV shows you can search movies um, all the movies I've searched has not let me down um, TV shows I don't know how well they're updated but I'm pretty sure that they're pretty close I'm not gonna say a day after they air on TV but they're they're pretty close and pretty good um, you got all these, all these submenus and files. So I'm gonna go to year. Um, you also have the option for see 2017. They're gonna be movies that are still in theaters. Not really a fan of those bootleg movies because the quality is crap, and um, you know people use you know really crappy devices. And then when you when you try to record on a big screen TV, it's just it's it's really no, it just doesn't look good at all. So we'll go to 2016, and. All the movies that are in theaters are on here, and you can see them and watch them, but the problem is, is trying to find a good quality movie that works good. Um, never Heard a Lion. Don't know what that is. Hacksaw Ridge. Uh, that's not out. I, I you generally look for movies that are just, you know, come out on DVD that are just released because they'll stream them. Or even a couple weeks before, they'll have really good streams on Pirate Bay and etc. But here's Hidden Figures. Uh, that's not out on DVD yet. So it'll still probably be a theater, movie theater quality movie. Also, um, if you don't download your movies through Pirate Bay, um, I use the Fire, not the Fire Stick, I use um, a flash drive and I plug it into the back of the PS4 Pro. And um, I use Yi-Fi on Pirate Bay, he's the best one. But anyways, so you got these guys here. Um, they go down a list depending on, I assume, quality wise and the best streams available always look for the HD ones because anything else is, is poor unless you have a really crappy tube TV or something hey more power to you but stick with HD and if you have a five megabyte per second stream upload then you should be fine you'll see it's kind of a crappy stream it says it's HD that looks like a not even a 720p on a and once again, this is a 4K TV, so that affects it. Um, I can skip, fast forward a little bit here. 
My sound bar's turned down. Let's turn it up. They're offering a full scholarship. All you have to do is get there. So there's cool. that, and that looks absolutely horrible, and I can't stand it. So anyways, um, there you go, guys. Uh, that's my... That's how you get after it and get to it. Um, rate, subscribe, like my YouTube channel. Anything else you guys have questions for, send me a message, whatever you got. Um, if you're one of my people that I've you know, bought this for, or I've, you know, you, you purchased it, uh, I bought it for, if you purchased it through me, um, you got a lifetime you know, troubleshooting guy, I'll be available to troubleshoot and help you fix the problem for the rest of your life, life of the device. So thanks man, appreciate it. Everybody for watching. Sorry it's been four years or so since I've posted. Nothing's great's happened since then. But there you go. Um, you'll also notice the, I've got the PS4 Pro there and I've got the Xbox One S and my crap load of wires that I can't seem to hide or do anything with because I don't want to live in this house forever. But all right, guys.